Hey, and it's your girl, Dot Out of Love, Tara Reader. Dot, I be the realest. Man, I just kept getting interrupted by people who keep calling my phone. I guess it's not meant for me to get this message across, but I'm going to get it across anyway. For my cancers, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. But someone's not seeing a future, or you're not seeing a future with someone. That's what I get with three of wands in reverse. Someone's not being creative in their mind. Or they're, yeah, somebody's not thinking about the future. Like, someone don't see them in their future, or somebody's not being creative about the future right now, okay? Cancer, general love reading. Okay. Yes, yeah, some, uh, somebody's want a new offer with a young, probably with a younger person, with a Pisces, but it's not time. Like, you feel like it's not time. Like, if you're trying to offer this person something, you either did it with a person, or someone's new, or someone's new, or you're probably going to someone that's a Pisces and you're talking to them, but time is not on your side, okay, with this Pisces. I feel like you're missing this Pisces, Okay. Oh, Cancers, what's going on with you and this Pisces? General love reading. Okay, I feel like you need to stop judging yourself. You feel like you can't reach your pinnacles without this person, I feel like. Like, you can't move forward without this person. Like, I feel like you feel like this is the person that you you see in your future, but you don't feel like this person see a future with you. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Okay, period. But someone's not reaching their pinnacles like they are, like they say they are. And some, I feel like someone's moving forward. You feel like someone's either moving forward without you or you're moving forward without them. Either you're dealing with the fire sign or I feel like it's water sign in here. And you gotta, you want to express yourself to this person, but you feel like this person was probably blocking you or moving forward without you. Okay. Or this person wasn't talking to you. And this person was moving on without you. So that caused you emotion. Like someone, now someone was coming in as playing the magician. You feel like this person is trying to like basically like put on like a persuade, like finesse you in a way. Like, and you feel like either you been off too much you can handle. Like, because you probably really felt for this person, cancer. Or this person probably felt for you and you been off too much you can handle. So now I feel like you... You don't, you're not ready to let this person go, even though that you know that this person have multiple lovers and stuff, like options, and you probably like watching this person or this person like, I don't know, something in that type of source, but you know that you have to let this person go because you feel like you cannot trust this person or this person feel like they cannot trust you. This is either a past person you're with or you're watching a new person or you're missing the person, okay? Spiritual guidance. Verify if there's general love reading. Yeah, so someone don't want to take time away. Someone's not going to take time away. Because they was like, I'm not with these other people. But someone's going to come in and try to start rackets in the home. Like, I feel like someone's going to try to come in and start some shit in your home, Cancer. Spiritual guidance. Verify if there's general. Or that's what's going on right now in the home. Like, okay, I don't want to take all them cards. Spiritual guidance, verify this. Okay, someone's not going to play the fool. They're going to take off that fucking facade. And they're going to like, okay, you're not about to play me. Because um, basically you deal with this in the past. And you're not going to pour no more love into nobody's cup who hurt you within the past, period. Like, you don't see your past in your future, period. Like, whoever you're dealing with, like, you're, you're ready probably to, like, whoever you once was dealing with or wasn't, like, like, come on now, they want to come in, they want justice. Someone wants justice out of this thing that they caused in the past. Okay, so I'm probably like a reconciliation. Either you're dealing with a Libra too, spiritual guidance, some type of justice that they want from you. Because you, you have Cancer, Aries, water signs in your chart. Different water signs. Yeah, some union that was broken that caused somebody to move forward. Like, some disloyalty, some deception, okay? But you cancer, spiritual guidance. But someone's going to be stuck in hayman mode. Like, they, they're not moving anywhere. Like, yeah, someone's going to come out and start communicating more. Spiritual, someone's going to try to reach out. But you're going to have to follow your intuitions, period. Spiritual guidance, verify this general love reading for our cancers. 
Cancer General Love Reading, December 16th to the 31st, Spiritual Guidance. Yes, someone's going to put something in the end, put something to an end because they're tired of the cycle. Someone's not coming in with a real offer. This is a new person. They just coming in because they want to know what the fuck you've been up to. They really don't really want to offer you nothing to see you reach any type of pinnacles, period. Whoever this person is, they just coming in to play fucking games with you. This how you doing with this person? Are you about to finesse? Somebody's trying to come in and trying to finesse or... You trying to finesse somebody while you still thinking about another person. Spiritual guidance. Yeah, somebody has somebody in a third party relationship and somebody knew that. So somebody is not going to move forward with this person. Knowing that they knew you had them in a third party relationship. They're like, uh-uh. Who the fuck you think I am? You think you about to come back into my life and finesse me? Yeah, and this is cancer, but they're not going to move forward with that shit. Somebody just trying to come in and be nosy to fuck up some shit. Period. Yeah, somebody's already stable. Cancer's probably already stable. Probably a Scorpio trying to come in. Somebody's that that type of nature. But somebody's trying to come in, but you're already stable. And you already have a new beginning, okay? Period. Or you want a new beginning with someone else. Yeah. Somebody's trying to come in dealing either... Because we have Capricorn in here, okay? We have... Someone already know that they've been backstabbed, but they don't want to let somebody go because somebody know that they move forward. So now they're watching this person carefully now because they probably planted seeds with this person. Somebody's going to start watching you closely, Cancer, because they're not going to be trusting you or what you got going. Whatever money plans you got going, saying you got going, they probably know you probably out there trying try to, whoever you in a relationship is not trusting you. But it's some legal documents that's about to be signed, some paperwork that's about to be signed, like a resume dealing with you or some type of family source, some money, some about some seeds. Okay? Someone is not going to move in swift and fast with you. Spiritual guidance. Too many cards. Verify this in love, really. Yeah, somebody, and then you're probably watching somebody. You're probably watching somebody online. I feel like somebody's watching you online. And they see that you're happy. But you know that you can't build with this person. That you know that you're not going to be able to build with every person you're trying to build with. So you're probably watching psychics or going to people online. You're watching somebody online to make you happy or whatever the case may be. Because lately, like, you've been trying to build your home. Like, your pinnacles. Like, you've been trying to build. So for somebody to come in and fuck that shit up, I feel like... Cancer, you're not about to really play the fool. You're not about to play the fool because this person probably in their head about you. And you know that this person had multiple offers. I mean, lovers and offers, period. So, but they're not about to come in and they're not about to play the fool. But you're going to probably try to take a leap of faith with this person just to see what the fuck they talking about. Like, comment, and subscribe. Take what resonates, leave what don't. It's your girl and I'm out.